So today we're going to do a water test. We're going to race these different drainage pipes. Types of pipes we are racing today. Over here we have 4 inch perforated ADS. Here we have 4 inch perforated PVC. And over here we have our patented 4 inch uh, high octane designed by French drain man, Robert Sherwood. Over here we have 3 inch perforated ADS and we have the three inch uh, manufactured French drain pipe they have at the Home Depot, which is just wrapped with uh, styrofoam filling. And we didn't put any rock around these, so we'd give them the biggest advantage of all so that they don't have any restriction. The setup skipped to 107 to see the water tests. So what we have here is standard inch and a half clean gravel. We washed it all, equal heights, equal containers, and we ran equal lengths of pipe, the cap on the end of each one. The only water that can, that can penetrate the tile is straight through the holes. So we set these up with caps on the end to run the full, each pipe is run the full length of the, of the container, and it has a cap siliconed on the end of each one. So the only water can go through the holes. Let the water tests begin. So here's 10 gallons through three inch perforated. Results. So first off, we're gonna race the two box store pipes so we can get a winner of those and then we'll race the high octane. Uh, a lot of people think that this pipe is better because it's a smooth wall and that water would flow faster. So we're gonna go ahead and test that out right now. So here we go. One, two, three. So you can see how much faster the corrugated pipe is relieving the water. The PVC is still trying to catch up. This is installed with the holes down as any contractor would recommend on a French drain installation. One advantage that the four inch corrugated has is it comes in 100 foot rolls, whereas the PVC is 10 foot sticks. So what that means is you have a coupler every 10 feet, and that's a weak spot every 10 feet for shifting, for root penetration, and just to catch sediment. Results. So we have a clear winner here. The reason that it won is because it has perforations all the way around the pipe. Even though they're small and there's less of them, it relieves the water faster. It's often believed that the smooth wall is a better pipe, that it's gonna relieve water faster or better, and it just doesn't. We just proved that right now. So now we're gonna race the corrugated pipes. All right, here we go. One, two, three. So you can see how much faster it relieved the water by looking at the side of the bucket. And when you're in the middle of a torrential rain or a heavy rainstorm, every bit counts. That's gonna depend on how much water you can move down your tile and how much air is transferring in the opposite direction to break siphon. It all makes a difference. Especially once you have continual rains going for days and days at a time. It will, it will basically saturate the area. The tile will get full. It won't be able to relieve itself. And so every bit that you move faster, the better off you are. The other advantage that French Drain Man's pipe has is it's virgin plastic as opposed to recycled plastic. This is much stronger pipe. I can stand on this pipe and it won't move. I stand on this pipe and it will bend. Results. Bonus round. So now we're gonna do one final test here and I went ahead and put a plug on the end of the tile 
So now we have a plug on the beginning of the tile and the end of the tile. The only way that water will exit the tile right now is through the holes going in and coming out. So we just want to see what kind of flow we get through this high octane pipe. Ready? Yeah. Go. Keep it coming. So that's a good demonstration about how much water will move. That was 20 gallons that was relieved in probably 15 seconds or less. So that's a good demonstration on how this patented pipe by Robert Sherwood is far superior to any other tile that's on the market for drainage. It's virgin plastic. Um, it has the most inlets of any pipe that you can buy and it's the strongest 